Hey, I just wanted to share with you, with you my pen haul from Disney World. This right here is my new lanyard, and it is double-sided. It's got Mickey as a pumpkin on one side, and Minnie, her little witch's hat, and her bow on the other side. Let's start in with the pins that I actually traded for. I couldn't even begin to tell you what I traded these pins for, but these are the ones that I traded for. I got two Tinkerbell pins. With the one that I already have, I don't see how I can fail to have the rides pin set. Um, because I've already got one or two of these. And I collected all of these. This is a new grouping to me. The teapots and the teacups. Uh, these three right here, I know for a fact they're scrappers. But each and every one of them I wanted for a different reason. This one because I collect Disney cats. This one because I love Jessica Rabbit. And this one because it's an off color enough from the original that to me it looks like a completely different pen. So I like it and I was willing to trade for that. Move on to the fruits that I was able to collect. At one point I had the purple grapes and I mistakenly traded them out for something. I got, I believe their names are Cy and Am and Cheshire Cat to add to my Disney Cats collection. I got a Wizarding Mickey candied apple. I like the foods that are shaped like Disney stuff. Got a couple of cute little Jiminy Cricket pins. These are the Goopy pins that I was able to collect. This one in particular is part of a set that shows the character's footprints. And the only one I was really interested in getting in that one was Goofy. And honestly, when I picked this one up, I was thinking that it was part of the Wilderness Explorer badges. But, now isn't this the truth? I only need one more. And I passed on one and I'm just kicking myself that said, this isn't a pen. <sighs> Woulda, shoulda, coulda. There's this neat, really neat Walt pin. Got an Eeyore pin, Alice's dress, one of those cuddly little otters. And I picked up this gazelle pin more because I actually like Shakira, who voices gazelle. So at some point I may trade it off. Here are the three Wilderness Explorer badges that I collected. And now I am only missing the Puzzle Piece Wilderness Explorer badge. I was able to get Hatbox Ghost from Haunted Mansion. I got three Mickey Ears character pins, one of which Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas. And this is the grouping of Peter Pan pins that I picked up. Now, a couple of these have been given away to my daughter, but I wanted to show that I picked them up and I got all of these in trade. So, on your next trip to Disneyland or Disney World, happy pin trading.